Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Aisha Nabila Binti Rosli and today I'm going to present on the evolution of the built environment. Um, so first of all, uh, my house is located at Taman Impian Morini. Um, it is uh, in Sarjana Impian which is um, nearby the Kacang Town and it is divided into a sub uh, taman. So this is my for, uh, floor plan, house floor plan, and the first floor plan, and also the second floor plan. Um, I do have five bedrooms uh, and also four toilets, uh, one dining room, one living room, and so one kitchen in my house. So the first one, the relationship between man and the creator, respect for relation consists of the creator. City as center of learning and civilization, and also neighborhood you need based on educational uh, institution. So in Sojuna Impian, we do have um, two secondary school for ages between 7 and 12, and also we have high school for ages between 13 until 17. And uh, in the high school, they do have a KA class, uh, that's main class Aliran Arab, they take Arabic, uh, Arabic in PTJ and also SPM. And actually we also have, uh, in Sajan Impen, also have the Sekolah Menengah Agama Persekutuan, Smart Kajang. And uh, in Masjid Sajan Impen, we have a Kafa school that allows elementary students to learn about uh, basic Islam. So the Nakli study, the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him. Seeking knowledge is an obligation upon every uh, Muslim. That's mean that as a Muslim, we need to learn every day. So based on my house, this is um, the study place and also bookshelf that look at a lot, a lot, a lot of book um, in here. The first one is um, yeah, my study place um, while doing this uh, task. Okay, the next one is conservation of environment on nearby park and also translate the glory of created, created through physical manifestation. Um, yeah, as you can see that um, in nearby park, we have a trees on that park because normally um, the park doesn't really have a tree except for the um, cross. And also as for the translate the glory of the creator, um, we in my house also have the openings that allows natural source of light and also natural ventilation. Um, as you know, it is um, all come from the creator itself. <clears throat> And the next study is Dan janganlah kamu membuat kerosakan di muka bumi Sesudah Allah memperba memperbaikinya Dan berdoalah kepadanya dengan rasa takut Dan harapan sesungguhnya Allah, uh, Rahmat Allah amat dekat kepada orang-orang yang berbuat baik So the next one uh, the next one is justice um, Activities and elements at the rightful And also appropriate place So yes, yeah, you can see in um, first floor plan um the toilet is actually located at appropriate place it is uh, hidden from the um living room and also the new room dining room and yeah since we have like seven members in my house we do jumat prayer at living room because that is the only vacant place that is available um and also balance and equitable distribution of development as you can see we have two sekolah kebangsaan sekolah kebangsaan sarjana impian and also sekolah kebangsaan sarjana impian dua and one sekolah menengah kebangsaan sekolah menengah kebangsaan sarjana impian and one sekolah menengah agama smart kajang so um yeah the residents around here can actually choose uh, which school they want to um, send their children to. And also justice and unity, uh, justice provision of facilities meet the minimum standard. We do have school and also mosque and a shop lot and also community center and park. And as for the unity, provide development and enhance interaction. So as you can see, school for education and purpose, that's meant that of course we do interact with um, other students other people around our ages and also most for aging purpose and yeah we can do a gym of prayer there and also part for interaction with the neighbors and also shop a lot that have kedai um Aceh stuff laundry restaurants mama tadi car cleaning and also bakery and yeah community center next the compassion our planning and development decision and action consider effects to the individual society and also environment so uh, just like two or three years um Nearby, we have the MRT station, and yeah, they do consider to um to give us the uh, MRT for the pass in our um in our housing area, and that bus is very easy uh, and also very convenient and cheap. I have seen um 
back then when when I in high school I seen uh, have seen that um, the residents actually take this bus to go to um, to the work at early in the morning and yeah. Next, completion, the planning and design of buildings should produce art and also beauty with high aesthetic values while reflecting religious and cultural his heritage. So, um, yeah, this is one of the most uh, in my in Sajana in Ben Dom that reminds me of Islamic uh, architecture, uh, the Nakli study, and I did not create the jinn and mankind except to worship me. And the next one is the provision of facilities beyond the minimum standard. So, yeah. In Sajana in Penn, we do actually have a golf club nearby and also a cleaning, a lot of schools and mosques and also community centre. And trustworthy and credibility. Um, planning must be based on actual uh, facts. So yeah, um, all the spaces in my house actually meet the minimum requires, requirement standards. Uh, that's mean uh, we do have toilets, we do have bedrooms, living room, dining room and also kitchen and also the ceiling high is uh, mid. The minimum standards, um, it is more than two meters, of course. And next one is listening and accepting public opinion if it leads to a better uh, living environment. So yeah, uh, in my taman, we have a community and also some organization that will update the news around neighborhood. And if there is any problem regarding, regarding to the neighborhood, they will ask and discuss, they will ask the resident and discuss it together. So the next study. When your Lord said to the angels, indeed, I will make upon the earth an successful, uh, successive authority, they said, will you place upon him one who causes corruption during and shed blood? Uh, where, while we declare your praise and sanctify you, Allah said, indeed, I know that which you do not know this. Um, how this is actually related, uh, this nakli, is, uh, this talent is actually related with the um, Khalifah. Okay, the next one is the relationship between men and the environment. So, cleanliness and beauty. Since mom really loves to the gardening, she likes to plant orchid. And yeah, in front of my house, we have a plenty of uh, plants. And this is only half of it. Uh, yeah, and also the authority, um, actually, they do have a garbage pickup regulation on every Monday, Thursday, and also Sunday. And as for the um, house rules, we need to throw out the domestic waste every night to prevent from the smell of others. And the next one is preservation, uh, the environment and also sustainable natural resources. Yeah, uh, as you can see, uh, they still plant the trees around the park. The next one, the relationship between men and men. So the first one, respecting privacy and also division of spaces. Um, yeah, this is my second house floor plan. We do have um, room for parents, must bedrooms for parents. Bedroom two, bedroom two is for uh, my brother, and also bedroom three and bedroom four um, are for girls. Since we have four uh, girls in my house, and yeah, room is protected uh, for parents. Yeah, boys and girls. And the value of encouraging interaction and acquaintance. Um, in big in kitchen. Um, since my kitchen is quite big, and all of family members can be at the kitchen at the same time, and we can do the rewang together. Um, yeah. When we were um, when it was ideal fitri, we do rewang together, and also when the guest um is coming over, we also do the rewang together. And as for the dining room and living room, it is located located uh, beside each other with uh, no walls because we want to in, uh, to have interaction between family uh, members at the living room and also dining room at the same at the same time, and also the part that helps interaction between the neighborhood. And as for the peace and security, as you can see, we do have um a, a gate and also um. A fully function uh, doorknob and also grill. It is more into a security and also privacy. And as for the curtains, it will, it is needed uh, to prevent from the people outside see the inside. All right. The next one is to respecting the right of the individual. So yeah, bedroom three and bedroom four. Since we have uh, four girls and we need to share um the bedroom, so we have um. 
we get our own bed, our own bed. And yeah, we have two toilets that connected both a room and also have doors, but the toilet two is actually for the bedroom four. Meanwhile, the toilet three is actually for the bedroom three. And um, we keep the door uh, lock on one door unless uh, we want to know each other. So we just um, open, it, open that door. And um, cooperation, sensitivity, and mutual respect. Um, in my... Um, in my residential area, we do have a gotong royong. It will be had every six months, uh, but certainly due to the coronavirus, it, it's been two months since we do have uh, one. We last have one, and then as yeah, I still remember back then we have um a uh, chamon hari raya where every neighbors uh, will come and bring their own uh, foods. It's like a potluck, and also. Mm, the neighborhood around my house is so respectful to each other. Uh, there is no anti kiah and anti chaya gossiping and spreading false news around. And also, um, we do still have the culture of exchanging food um, with the neighbors. And I do really love my neighbor neighborhood. Um, and also a WhatsApp group to update any news regarding to the neighborhood. Um, the Nakli study. Yahya related to me from Malik, from Said Ibn Abi Said al makuri from Abu Shurai al kabi that the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, whoever believe in Allah in the last day should speak good or be silent. Whoever believe in Allah in the last day should be generous to his neighbor. And also, whoever believe in Allah in the last day should be generous to his guests. His welcome is for a day and a night, and his hospitality is for three days. Whatever is more than that is a sadaqah. It is not halal for a guest to stay with a man until he becomes a burden. So my highlight is um, we need to be kind and also be good to our neighbor. And as for the consultation, a, de a decision sometimes are made together. Like when I want to decide with Ashufada on my studies um, and also celebrate Raya at which side of their uh, mom or dad on that year and more. Um, in conclusion, as you can see, relationship with men and credit, I do cut uh, four out of four points for the respect for knowledge and conscious of credit. However, I and also compassion, I do get three out of three points. However, um, the justice, trustworthy and credibility and unity, I like one of point each and I managed to only get 15 out of 16 points. Um, meanwhile, as for the relationship man with the environment, I didn't get the point of um, economic and effective use of resources. However, I do get cleanliness and beauty and also preservation uh, of the environment and sustainable natural resources. Um, so the next one is relationship between man and man. So I do get all the points, um, Six over six, uh, we share respecting privacy and division of space, the value of encouraging interaction and equitance, peace and security, respecting the rights of the individ individual, cooperation, sensitive, sensitivity, and mutual respect, and also consultation. So, in my conclusion, uh, based on the analysis, it shows that my house is actually based on the relationship between men and men as it gets uh, all six over six. If it's content of Al Fatiha, it is more into Ubudiyah, where it focuses more on the so social interaction. The relationship between man and the creator seems to be at distant, distant as it only gets 13 out of 16. That's mean the TDP on my, the TDP on my house does not really focus on the Rubia and the law of the building TDP is not fully applied to the law system. As for the relationship between man and the environment, I only able to get 2 out of 3 which mean they do focus on Mulkiyah but it's still not enough and it might be lacking at the certain area where it within the economy or as maybe defense and politics. And in conclusion, uh, the total point for my housing area is 21 out of 25. And as for my opinion, I think it is uh, quite high, but still need to improvise, improvise in certain areas to achieve the concept of total planning doctrine. Um, I think that is all from me. Thank you.